Hey guys, thank you for joining me here. My name, of course, is Mr. Mocha Lover, and let's continue playing as the Russian SFSR right now. Last time, at the end of last episode, where I'm picking literally right back up, um, I said I would distribute the naval, my naval fleet, my fleet, task forces, uh, better. But as you can tell, right now, um, it's pretty bad. Like, I don't... No, I want you to merge together. Like, I want everyone to come, like, here or something. Oh, actually, everyone come this way. Yeah. Come here. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and merge them right now. I mean, this is quite literally picking up right off the last episode, so... Oh, very nice, very nice. Um, let's see. We've got a couple more dockyards. Great. Um, I'm making some subs already. I think creating better cruiser holes would probably be the best at the moment. These things are just so good. And I'm, I always like putting these things in Leningrad, just because it's a level 10 port. And actually, before we do that, can I upgrade these things at all? I think torpedoes is already the best we can make it. Anti-air? I should actually probably be get better anti-air. Radar, maybe we have? No? No, we already have pretty much the best of what we can do at, at the moment, so that's pretty good. Pretty darn good. Alright, more research. Even better marines, because we're going to need some really hard hitters. Cool. Hope you guys are having a good, 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 good day. Um, I'm doing all right, I suppose. Um, I just want to remind you that I can't really c reply to comments because of my current situation. Because I will be away, unfortunately. So, But, regardless, uh, I'm still here and making some videos. Go ahead and do that. Combine, you two. And the Swiss Confederation is gone. We did declare war on the Swiss last time. Yeah, I want both of you here. Um, where's the cancel repair button? Wait, where? Why did you go all the way back to Leningrad? I want everyone to come here. If I lose a couple ships, you know, I might, but whatever. We have been bombing quite a few enemy ships, so we do have some plane coverage around these parts. And, of course, the UK is invading us once again. Lovely. That doesn't make very much sense for our... Sh oh, we sunk the pride of the fleet. Converted battleship hole. Nice. But, like I said, we have taken out the Swiss. Go ahead and put some Coast Guards. I call them Coast Guards, but they're really Coast Guard and Resistance Suppression Soldiers. Let's do that. Concerning the whole of France, I mean... I suppose we could do this. i got enough Coast Guards for now anyways. Um, but da dum Come on. Good. It's a little laggy, but, you know... When is it not laggy? Let's just throw a bunch of guys over here just in case they navally, they navally invade us once again because it looks like that's exactly what they're doing. So do that. Whatever. You know. Happens. Uh, make your way to Cadaz. You make your way over up to... Oh my goodness. Where are you at? Yeah, you guys. Oh, the Americans are a bunch of funny people here. Cool. And you know what? Let's go ahead and throw on you guys. And I'm going to begin the naval inv planning a naval invasion. So, you guys will invade... Royce... I'm, I have no idea how to pronounce that. You guys invade... Ah, uh, do the same place since you're pretty close. Go to Edinburgh. And do that place to get to Royce. I, apparently, I'm going to invade Scotland first. Oh, wait. Or not. Hold on, let's do that. Oh, so that, those guys are invading there. Okay, something's really... Hmm. Maybe I can only plan so many naval invasions at once. So be it. I want you three up here anyways. Take you three. Come up to... Let's see, from here. Come up to here. Come up to here as well. So we'll invade... Using at least 12 divisions into here first, which will be good. 12 into here first. And then... I could probably use a couple more. Supply situation should be okay here anyways. And invade probably even more of the UK. But obviously we can't do that at the moment. So let's speed it up just a little bit. Last time we took out Tibet. Now we're going to justify on Afghanistan. Which I haven't done yet. Oh, it only takes 10 days. Nice. And then we'll get to Oman and other places like that. Actually, for you guys... 
You don't need to be right there right now. These guys, I am using a few Persian soldiers. Go ahead and surround Yemen. I know the supply sucks. And then... You guys, will go ahead and take out Oman. Which will just add them to the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. Or the Arabian... Not, it's not the Kingdom anymore. It's the Assembly of something. Ooh. Nice, an American battleship has been sunk. The Republic of the Arabian Assembly. What a bunch of great people there. Absolutely phenomenal people. Alright, so we have everyone here. Let's go ahead and make a better task force. One battleship with another battleship. Throw in a light cruiser and hopefully seven destroyers. But it's lagging pretty hard. Maybe you're repairing. Are you all repairing? Oh, you're not even there yet. No, 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 don't leave. What the hell are you doing? No, what the heck? Oh, you are you have missions, that's why. God dang it, I'm stupid. Just go back, come on. Don't waste my time here. Alright, awesome. Do that, and then do that. Do one, and then seven. That's good enough for that. For now. Take you, and we'll just literally split this in half. Nice. Alright, that's better. We have seven... Oh, we still have another seven here. These guys are getting, kind of getting bombed. Uh, screens are okay, actually, for this group. So I'm not too worried about this. Everyone, go ahead. And repair. Repair now, which is fine with me. Just don't get killed. And Oh, God, there's so many bad places here. Don't repair here. Don't repair here. Or here. Um, That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. That's okay, that's okay. Four is not great. Anything less than five, I don't really want to use. Two, three, three. A lot of these places aren't super great. Four, ten, eight, five is fine. Two sucks. Eight is actually pretty good. Five is pretty good. Benghazi, no thank you. That's fine, that's not good. No, 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 no. Um, that's good, that's fine. I don't think they'll even repair up here, but that's fine. No, that's good. No, 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 no. And no. Alright. Not bad. Go ahead, let them repair. You guys are doing pretty well. Go ahead. Oh, and we sunk another. The pride of the American fleet. Nice. Good. The battleship was gone. Finding... More and more destroyers all over this place. Oh my goodness, there are a lot of convoys, but they're protected by American ships. The Germans are still loving their submarines, and... Well, the German subs aren't doing great. Right here, right now, uh, we're losing the air superiority over the Netherlands. Or the Benelux region, which is kind of weird. But something tells me, I think we've got probably enough planes to cover this. Good, good, good. I will deploy even more planes when we get closer to the invasion of the actual uh, invasion of the British Isles. So that will be good. Ships. You guys. How are we doing? So what I want you to do is naval invasion support. So we're going to need Mallorca area, this area, as well as the eastern Mediterranean. Super fire mains, good. Go ahead and do that. Happy 1949, everybody. Outdated equipment, super heavy battleship hull. Pretty standard now. Pretty standard to not have enough equipment. Tanks, we're doing better. We need more medium bombers. Are we producing military factories? Yes, we are. And we can go to war with Afghanistan now. Ah, nothing like the Russian invasion of Afghanistan. As we're still preparing to invade. Alright, I'll give it like, maybe, maybe a few days before we actually invade. I do want to tell you guys to go ahead and invade yourselves if you can do a great job. Um, actually, God dang it, I forgot about this. Uh, actually, you have more than enough range. Go ahead and invade and bomb the hell out of Heraklion. Alright, guys, go whenever you can. If you're not exactly ready to go, well, I don't really care. And we've, we're going to head and invade Afghanistan. Ah, uh, look at that lag. Nice. Nice. Very nice. Oh. 
shut down an enemy plane because they don't like our convoys. Well, that's too bad. You're going to like my convoys whether you like it or not. And because I remember, there's a lot of guys here. Nothing says in the invasion of Crete like three nuclear bombs. Ah, Chania. There was less than half a million people living here on the island. With these three nukes, there should be like maybe 200,000. Maybe. Ah, the pride of the British fleet has been sunk once again. Uh, it looks like they've actually re-invaded us. But what else is new? So take you. And invade the Netherlands once again. Because the British just don't learn their lesson the first time. But this is not as bad as before. Oh my goodness, yeah. The British fleet just really doesn't want to survive anything, do they? American convoy and then two more American convoys. British fleet is not... Oh my god, that's pathetic. Nine, Britannia does not rule the way. They have less than ten ships. Oh, it's so heartwarming to see. Actually, how many planes do they have? That's probably a better question to ask. Um, they got actually not a ton of planes. That's a lot fewer than I thought they would. Interesting. Very interesting, actually. Recon. Uh, we're going to need some recon companies. As how much longer? I'm going to wait till we get advanced landing craft first. So that we can have an extreme invasion capacity. Naval invasion capacity. So I can invade using, at one time, a ton of divisions. And then before I actually invade, I will use a bunch of nukes. And just strategically bomb the living hell out of the Brits. Or at least something like that. You guys, go ahead and go to the Coast Guard divisions. Uh, this. Now that's more American convoys sunk. Another tank division for our good old boys. We're doing nothing right now. Uh, send. Hmm. A few to La Corona. Send you guys over there. Send you three to, eh, send them to Lisbon, except for one. Who helped defend Porto for now. Not really concerned. There's not really a huge use for tanks. I mean, I guess I could help take out this area, but I've already sent out my infantry this way, so I'm not too concerned about it. Nice. Nice. How are the invasions going? Well, we have taken Mallorca. Awesome. Uh, send you two, and I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys to move on over to Turkey, if you can. Invite Cyprus next. Alright, guys, this is a little pathetic. I know, I know your check divisions, but you should be a little better than this. I know they're very dug in, and they, may, they might have a tank or two. But they should be able to do pretty well. I mean, look at this guy's beard. Holy crap. Napoleon? We're fighting Napoleon Zervas? But Napoleon? Are you a descendant of Napoleon? Because look at that beard. I mean, my goodness. Look at that. It's like a, it's like a forest beard. Oh, my goodness. Oh, so good. Oh, we're sunk in another American battleship. No wonder that they never try to attack the Japanese Navy. They're, the American... Navy right now is so pathetic. Which means the Japanese fleet must be getting just massive. Absolutely huge. Oh. Okay, that's all it took. Just an, an invasion of Crete. Not even taking Heraklion. Nice. Now I want you guys to go ahead and invade from Turkey as well. And invade that part of Cyprus. Which will be awesome. And by that time, we should be able to invade. Or at least begin planning the invasion of the UK. As they are attacking our ally once again. Go ahead and put them out of their mi misery. Planes. Doing okay. Doing okay. Um, They have a lot of enemy planes here. Actually, what I'm thinking of at the current moment is this. I'm going to actually put a lot of maritime bombers around different areas. Well, I guess heavy fighters as well. Um, Let's see. I don't want you clogging up my resources... Or my ability to see what I need to see. Let's get rid of those guys. Heavy bombers are fine. Uh, heavy fighter one, whatever. Nice. Ooh. Nice. Another American early destroyer sunk. You guys. Actually, I'm going to take you out of here. You don't need to be here anymore. What is this? Destroyer. So be it. I like using destroyers a lot more than light cruisers. Even though I know light cruisers are even better. Convoy. Convoy rating. I have told you to move over here, but I don't want you to be there. I don't want to put them in the English... Eh, you know what? Both of you guys, come over here. Take this off. Do the northwest or the, the sea area up here first. 
because I really don't want to put too many ships in the English Channel just yet. So we'll do that. Oh, we're stuck in a British light cruiser. There's not really many of those left, which is good. You guys have done a great, great job. Take this off and replace it with... Actually, you don't really need to replace it with very much. Go ahead and patrol. Go ahead, everyone repair just in case, because I will definitely need these guys later on. Take you guys. Do that, do that. Come to Ireland. And begin helping out the Irish. Except half of you will be doing this area as well. Because... Uh, 1,200 is a pretty good number. Merit oh, I need more mar maritime bombers. So then I'll use some medium bombers instead. Mm, close air support. Good, good, good. Anything here? American convoy sunk. Awesome. Let these guys deploy. Which is going to take forever to do. The invade, the reconquest of the Netherlands is going fine. The British, what are the casualties like? We've suffered 7 million total. Or 10.7 .7 for our faction. Well, the Allies have suffered over 22 million after the end of World War II. The British have suffered 6. Can Canada? Well, Canada. Canada. Canada has lost 1.5. A lot of people have died. Chile has lost over 150,000. Wow. The States have lost 4.5. Mexico has lost over a million. Wow. And Japan has lost only four. Some. Nice. It looks like... What is our subtract? We're doing really well since we did closed economy. We have sunk an American convoy, American convoy, American convoy, and destroyer. As well as nothing else. Cool. Is that the will of the people. Less supply consumption and then more daily communist support. Now, I could get less stability for a little more recruitable population. Eh. Revolutionary minds, more research speed. And that's okay as well. Melting pot, less stability, more monthly population, actually. That could be the one I want. I can't do hierarchy because I'm not fascist. Or I'm, I'm actually communist. I can't do that. Less... Uh, I think this was good. Melting pot. I lose a little bit of stability. But I do get more construction speed and more monthly population. That sounds like a fun thing to do since we have now less than a million manpower. You guys are doing great. They're, I'm not sure what they're doing about that place. Awesome. And... You guys are doing well. Come up to here. Use these guys. Oh, better radar. Nice. Oh, semi-modern somethings. And they should be almost there. Ah, it's going to take too long. Research stuff. 600 days. Yeah, let's do it. Why not? I don't care. And then nuclear bombs. Research speed, whatever. Um, 1949. 1949. This hurts your reliability. I don't like hurting my reliability too much. Infantry stuff sounds like fun. But nothing for 1949. Support companies. Eh, better maintenance companies sounds good to me. No one's really hurting Ireland, so I don't think I want to do Ireland just in case. I will send some guys around here, though. Because now we've completely surrounded the British Isles with planes that can bomb the hell out of enemy ships. Which will be great as long as the UK cannot get any supplies in. They have quite a few convoys, though. That's not good. And, of course, the Americans invaded, but they became a little stupid. And are going to have to perish. Great. Ooh. Very good, very good, very good. Anyone has else invaded? No good. Good, 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 good. And let us finish this up. With you guys. Ooh. Do that. And there you guys go. This really shouldn't be take too long. They canceled their lend lease. Supply situation, need more tanks, fighters, but that's pretty normal. Nothing really to worry about there at all. Lots and lots of bombers. Love it. Uh is there any place I have oh there it is. Alright, alright. We're invading, we're invading. They're getting to Konya. Not Kenya, but Konya. Not enough space. Go ahead and come actually come up here. Nice. The GNC. Eh, do that just in case. And they cancel the lend lease too. Understandable. Have we sunk something else? Yes. American convoy. An American convoy. With, there's a couple British ships there. Nice. Nice. Go ahead. Oh, we got so many heavy fighters. It's That's delicious. That's just tasty. 
Go ahead and do this. Do that part. I will have to do Scotland as well. God, the airport takes so much manpower up. Nice. Very good. Oh, that's as much as we can do there. Uh, that's as much as we can do there. 400 more. That's uh, just 200 more. Scotland should be okay. Northern England might be a little bit of a concern. But... Um, we're running out of medium bombers. I need to do some strategic bombing. Give me 100 of you guys. You'll do some close air support as well as... No, just close air support. And then give me those heavy bombers. It's only 100 heavy bombers, but... We're going to attack that, radar, and this. Yeah, that should be pretty good. I don't want to hurt the infrastructure too much, but I want to just be able, at least right now... To bomb the hell out of their airport so they can't rebuild and come back and hurt us. Do that area. That should be okay for now. Obviously, it only will work if I like carpet bomb the entire country. Nice, we got that done. Good job, guys. But we'll see what happens. Um. Hmm. Afghanistan is still going. Not going great, but it's still going. Afghanistan does take a while to take out, so... Go ahead and do whatever you can, Isa. Oh, look at this map. Oh, so much red. And a little white that we gotta get, gotta get rid of. Let's go ahead and justify on these guys. 10 days, not bad. 20 days, slightly worse. Go ahead when you can. Alexander, nope, you got nothing. And a lot of British convoys and stuff like that. All right. When are we going to get this? 30, oh, wow, 34 more days still? Jeez. Oh, look, a lot of convoys are coming around. Benelux. Uh, do I have any... Oh, I got some more room here. Maritime bombers, please. No, we're running out. I need to probably switch over some mar mar maritime bombers compared to these guys. Get rid of some heavy fighters in exchange for maritime patrol bombers. Um, do do that. What am I making? Can I take anything off? Guns are really good. Motorized rocket artillery. Do that. I need definitely need some more bombers immediately. So, yeah, British convoy. There's a lot of Danish and a few German subs. Nice. Some good stuff right there. Alright, anything we can do here? We get about 0.96 political power a day. That's not bad. Not great, but not bad. Alright, very long autosave period. Very long. We could use some more war support. Hmm. So, Central England or Northern England isn't going great. But Scotland's more than fine. Give me 400 more heavy fighters. From there, and an additional 400 more heavy fighters. The enemy will think we're invading Central England, which we will be a little bit, but... Oh, we lost two allied subs, whatever. Oh, we did sink two enemy ships. But, our my main invasion will be in Scotland. That'll probably be for the best. Uh, we got a couple guys up here. No, we don't actually have a couple guys up here yet. Um... Uh, send you guys up here too. I will need you when we invade, so. Good. Come up to Bardigan. Alright, ships. How are my ships doing? Because these will play one hell of a role before we do anything else. Oh, uh, not you. Give me the subs. That's not subs, that's a sub. Nice. Deselect you, combine. Kowalski analysis. How are you guys up to? Oh, you're just kind of hanging out. Patrol. I don't want to send these guys into English Channel, but these guys are kind of not great. So, I don't mind if I have to sacrifice them. Won't feel too bad about that. Repairing in Albania. Take that off. I want you actually all to come back to Vesser Ems. Go ahead and do that. 
Now, so the, at least the entire Mediterranean is done. Now, the invasion of the UK, I'm probably not going to use these Czech divisions. I'm like, I could throw them on to somewhere else, but what I am going to do is probably instead invade these small islands off of Africa, so this way they could be a staging ground for me to invade somewhere like Uruguay, Brazil, even though it would be easier to invade from here to over here to Brazil, if I have to invade Brazil. Hmm. Two invasion forces, one from the north. The northern, when you invade North America through the north, it really sucks. It's sometimes easier just to invade through South America than going up through Central America, maybe the Caribbean, as well as just, and then take out the United States. But I still have to think about the, the Japanese. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Well, if I can take these guys out, that would be kind of helpful. Come on down to Monrovia. All right, let's just let time go on right now. Right now, what can we use? Modern tanks, of course. Maritime patrol bombers and fighters. Yeah, I don't use those. Yeah, no thanks. And we can go to war with Yemen, which is awesome. And let's prepare for a little bit of lag, my friends. Cool. Loss of plane. American convoys everywhere. What is the USA up to? Construction, repair, a lot of manpower, quite a few ships sailed. Not a lot of divisions, actually. That's kind of good for us. They really don't have a lot of divisions. Take a look at Afghanistan. Afghanistan isn't feeling too good right now, but eh. That's alright. You must be coming a mountaineer or something, right, Isa? Mountaineer, yeah, 78% done. Desert Fox, 29% done. So if you can, just take your time, man. There's no rush, no rush. No need to rush. Oh my goodness. And before we do too much else, it looks like, oh, one of our allies is trying to invade up here. Well, they're not going so great, but what if... Oh, I can't nuke them. Darn. Alright, alright, British destroyers. I was thinking of something. Oh, yes. Armament effort's probably done. I could use more population growth. Good. So building maybe a few more military factories, of course. 100%, 100%, 100%. And throw in another nuclear reactor or two. Those could be very, very useful. Alright. Very not, very not bad. Very not bad. Convoy rating seems to be going okay. In the North Sea, we're not engaging too much. Northern England, Yemen is gone. We're still suffering quite a bit of enemy problems. Ireland, not really sure. This part of the sea, Western approaches, whatever. Why don't you do this area? Forget that part. Do that. North Sea. It's about pretty well contested. We have quite good naval supremacy here, though. Cancel Unlease. We found a lot of enemy ships here. I don't want to get bombed, though. That's my big thing. I just don't want to get bombed. Yvonne falls ill. We can go to war with Oman next. Great, 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 great. We got 819 factories. Isn't bad. Cool. Very awesome. What's going on down here? A lot of Yemenese convoys. Huh. Oh, we already lost a few ships. God dang it. They have destroyers. That's not good. Mm. That's why I sent my subs there first. Uh, I don't think that's enough range if I do that. Let's make it have this. And actually, let's get some radar. That would that might help. Yeah, that actually will help quite a bit. Throw on some in Friesland as well. Alright. Well, we lost six. So that's not good. Ooh. We lost... Oh, yeah, that's not good. That's really not good. That's why I don't want to do this area. Go ahead and repair. I don't want to lose that many ships. Yeah, we lost seven subs in exchange for one convoy. Yeah, that's not worth it. Yeah. Wait until we have our main naval fleet up here. Which is... Where? They have repairing best rams. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. No problems. No problems. You guys are not doing anything, so... I really don't want to send you over here, because we just experienced what could happen over here, but you know what? Let's do it anyways. You're not the greatest ships, so... And my goodness. 11 more days still? Come on, guys. Come on, man. 11 more days. Oh, the, the Italians invaded the Scottish Highlands. Great. Great. Our ships are getting probably bombed quite a bit. 
Nice. A couple more things with us. He canceled Lunleys. Yeah, we definitely have absolute air superiority. So, that's actually really good. Um, North Sea still is a problem. I probably will increase my conscription level as well. Just because I could use more manpower. North Sea, just go ahead and throw 400 more bombers over there. That will be good. And we shot down two enemy planes. Alright. Anything else around here? Destroyed an American destroyer. They really want to kill these Italians in the water. Mm hmm. Interesting. Sinking some American destroyers using our bad fleet to bait out enemy ships. They do have quite a few planes. But those planes should be getting pretty distorted from our own heavy fighters. That's why I love heavy fighters so much more than regular fighters. They're just The range is just too good to pass up on. Nice. Very good. Probably after the invasion of South America, as well as the UK and North America, I will go ahead and start deploying a lot more planes and ships to the Pacific. But seeing as UK is much closer to me at the moment, I will continue to attack the UK and invade them. All right, looks like Scotland has gone under. Oh, thank God. Okay, we got that. Let's go ahead and start planning the invasion. All right. So, actually, we can let time go on. You guys take quite a while around here. Go from here to invade Royst. You guys will invade from the same place. And invade the area next to Royst. And then... I'm actually probably going to increase the infrastructure in Norway before I do anything else. Do that, and do that area right there. You guys are coming from Christiansen. Christians land. Invade Edinburgh. This is going to kill any supply that the UK actually has that's actually good here. Uh, yeah, do that, and then we'll do one more. Because... God, God knows, say... I don't know what I'm even saying anymore. Just go ahead and destroy them. Uh, actually, invade Scapa Flow. That could prove to be very useful. Nice. Awesome. Let's do this. Ladder shooting sounds good to me. Very nice. Our Italian friends have done quite a good job invading the Scottish Highlands. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, an Australian convoy has been sunk on New Zealand. Go ahead, increase the infrastructure here, and that's all the time for we have here today. So today was pretty much just... Cleaning up different areas around the world, part two basically, as well as Afghanistan isn't still gone, but something tells me they'll be gone by the end of next episode, and we will begin an actual invasion of the UK next time, even though technically, technically, the, Eng the Italians have already done that for us. But regardless, I hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. Leave a like if you did, subscribe if you're new, and I will see you tomorrow. My god, Portugal has a lot of land. Thanks for watching, guys.